Hey guys, Anthony Leone, Roto Heat. Uh, gonna try to do a weekly waiver wire edition. Most waivers run Tuesday night, Wednesday morning. Try to get this out to you guys before then. Uh, even in the preseason, you know, we have waivers in a lot of different leagues. Everyone's just not always up for grabs. So this is uh, gonna be something to pay attention to prior to the season starting. And then obviously once, once the season rolls along, we start getting some real games here. So, busy weekend. Uh, Andrew Luck retired, and Lamar Miller went down. That's going to be the, the biggest theme here for these waiver wire grabs after this past weekend. Uh, we're going to start with uh, Demarie Crockett, undrafted free agent out of the University of Missouri. He checks in at 5'11", 200, 200, I'm sorry, 225 pounds. Uh, he's the bigger of the backs that we're talking about here. Uh, the other option on the team is Karan Higdon. He's also an undrafted free agent, but he's smaller. He's like 5'9", 5'10", uh, 203 pounds. So, I, you know, I, I think of the two, Crockett is the guy that you would want to try to target just because he has the bigger size and... You know, they used Higdon a lot in the third preseason game after Lamar Miller went down. And normally, when you have more usage, that means that they don't like you more. It means they want to get a better look at what you can do. So I think of the two, Crockett is the way to go. Uh, but Higdon is also someone to kind of keep an eye on and maybe add if you have the roster space uh, because he, he may uh, have some value. Uh, the third guy to add regarding this situation would be Jay Ajayi. Uh, he's a free agent right now. And, you know, I don't think it's likely they sign him and he gets a big role. But let's not forget, you know, a couple years ago, he was a top 30 dynasty pick on, in, in a startup. Uh, so, you know, if he's able to revive his career a little bit, uh, this might be the opportunity for him to do that. Uh, switching gears here. Andrew Luck announced his retirement. If you don't know that by now, um, you know, then you haven't really been paying too close attention to what's going on. Um, so that means Jacoby Brissett is in line to be the new starter. Uh, I think if it's a one QB league, you only add him if, if you really are desperate. Um, otherwise, he's a must add in a super flex league. Because, you know, he's shown in the past that he can be uh, better than average, I, I think is fair to say, for a fantasy quarterback with his rushing ability. Uh, Chad Kelly is the backup quarterback to Jacoby Brissett now. And I think he's a good ad in a super flex league if you have Brissett or plan on getting Brissett. Uh, just as extra depth, if you if you know if you have roster spot, it's always good to have the backups in those situations. Uh, keep in mind he is suspended for the first two games of the season uh, for violating the NFL's personal conduct uh, policy. But again, uh, he would be someone to add in a super flex league and a one QB league. You can uh, safely avoid uh, Mr. Irrelevant from 2017, Chad Kelly. Uh, that about wraps it up here. Uh, let us know if you have any questions. We'll be sure to help you out. Thanks. Don't forget, make sure you hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss any more fantasy football content from the rotoheat.com team. Also, right there, playlist. Hit it. Watch the videos. Do it. You want to. Do it.